Welcome, one and all, to another episode of the Good Improv Show. In fact, it's the final Good Improv Show of 2023. Oh, just a 20 of like I, I when you said that, I thought you meant of all time. No, no. Well, unless the world ends on 2024 New Year's, like we're all hoping it will. Yeah, yeah. All right, fingers crossed. Okay, this enough time, of this bullshit. This Let's time for sure. It. Come Actually, on. I'm not hoping the world ends. I'm hoping it goes on, it continues, wow. goes on forever and ever and ever. I got so much cyanide in here, you guys. Yeah? Mm. And so you guys signing up for your death cults. Just can't get behind it. No? But I can get behind the good improv show. Okay. And boy, golly, good. I'm grateful for that. Well, that's all you got to do then. Okay, so why don't we look at some words that we yeah. got from we, First audience. of all, we'd like to apologize uh, for the snow. Uh, the, the heating's off in here. Um, and, uh, and uh, there's a hole in the wall, so it's all coming through here. Um, yeah, it's pretty cold. We're, we're actually, uh, we're actually fi fighting off hypothermia right now. So, this is for you guys. We're still here, though, recording yeah, the show. that's right. This is a Christmas episode, correct? Yes, this is a Christmas episode. A special Christmas episode. Very yeah. special. Yeah. Actually, very special. Oh, what are you, are you putting a... A clown nose on? Oh, I see. Oh, okay, good. For a second, I thought he was putting on a cross. Because if you know, Jesus. For Jesus, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You subscribe Good. more to that. That's going to be uh, it's gonna be easy to work with. Yeah. So yeah. let's get the, let's let's get get the, the words. show of the world with these words going. We got lazy, we got solstice, and we got miraculous. Oh, oh. sweet lazy. Three fantastic words from fantastic people. All right. Yep. Now comedy Good. begins. Comedy begins now. Okay, Jesus. Uh, okay, uh, you've got a lot of good play. The loaves and the fishes, people loved it. The walking on water, uh -huh. people loved Pretty it. Pretty cool. Um, water into wine. Water into wine. Let's not forget loved that. Loved it. Raise that guy from the dead. I mean, how awesome Pretty was that? Pretty cool. Lazarus. Ram, hit him with the, yeah, whoever he was, yeah. people loved it. Yeah. Um, your last miracles, though, uh -huh. your last few, uh, we've gotten some, well, they've been, complaints have been kind of lackluster. Just kind of like lazy. Ho hum, I've heard. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, like you're not really trying anymore, and you're you're kind of losing your audience. Lazy miracles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little bit, a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. Like, like th that other wedding you went to, people were thinking, oh, he's gonna do the wine thing again. Is he gonna do the loaves and the fishes one? You just did the dishes. Right. I mean, they, I, they, no. <laughs> they were clean. They were clean. I just wanted to say and it was a pretty decent amount of dishes. Too, yeah, I suppose, it was a large but... amount, but I mean, it just it wasn't grabbing people the way that the other ones did. You know, everyone was having their water, thinking it was going to be wine. And, and the way yeah. you performed the miracle is just kind of rolling up your sleeves and yeah. getting in there. And you kind of just just did them, which I mean, I appreciate the hard work, but I mean, yeah. not, not really a miracle. Well, it's not it really is, a miracle. It is a miracle, though, isn't it? I cleaned all those dishes, and I did it actually pretty quickly too. With just elbow grease, I could have used Jesus magic, yeah, but no. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, fair. I guess there's a parable there and well, hard wait, work. Wait, wait, wait. Right there. You said it yourself. That's what the audience comes to see. Yeah. Jesus magic. They want that Jesus magic. They don't yeah. want to watch you just, like, really be good at washing dishes. But yeah. they've had the Jesus magic. And they so want more. They want more of it. They can't get enough of it. Right. So yeah. to give them, you know, some sort of miracle that really is like, wow, just wows them, I do something ordinary. I wash the dishes. All right. I mop the floor. All right. Well, that's... I clean the windows. Listen, look, we're just his agents, okay? If yeah, he wants yeah. to go down this uh, road, yeah, he can. Yeah, but, okay? but I mean, just hear us out. Hear us out. Hear us out. Okay? We, we have a few suggestions here of maybe some stuff you could work on, uh -huh. maybe some stuff that will get a lot of good play. Okay? How about this? Um, sawing a woman in half. You would, you'd put her back together. You'd put her back together. Yeah. I want to make that really clear. You would put her back together. Together, because I can, because I'm Cause you Jesus. You can, because you're Jesus. But you know, you you have her. Maybe she gets in like a box or a trunk or something, mm -hmm. and you put a saw blade through her, and everyone's like, "Oh my god!" And then you pull her apart. She wiggles her feet still. You know, you put her back together. Saw blade comes out. She gets out. Everyone's amazed. How about that? What do you think of that? That's but something we've been working on. I mean, does it fit the Jesus brand? I, well, hold on. Okay, fine, fine. What about this then? What about this? Okay, you wear start wearing a top hat Ooh. everywhere you go. Uh -huh. Maybe a, yeah. a cloak. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cloak. Yeah. Yeah. People, people. Or a cape, even if you want. Want you to be more stylish, they think. You know, like they think that's that's the best way Meet to do it. Meet in the middle, even if you want to go with a cape, you yeah. know. A cloak I I or no have. cloak. In the middle is the cape. Yeah. I haven't updated my wardrobe in some time. I'm still uh, doing the biblical robes. The sandals. Right. Yeah. So maybe some white gloves. You're right. A vest, fancy vest. We were thinking too, when you did your miracle, uh -huh. you know, we could have uh, some musicians there, you know, play something dramatic. Right. And then maybe, I don't know, maybe some guys with big pond fronds, like like really fanning them so your hair kind of blows back. 
You know, okay. you strike a dramatic pose once in a while. I like your original idea now, too, because I'd have the white gloves on. Yeah. yeah and if you sawed a woman in half, you'd expect there to be a whole lot of blood. But the fact that there would be no blood on the white gloves there or the top be. hat. Exactly. Or the exactly. jacket with the tails, did you say? Tails, yeah. not even the little vest. Yeah. Yeah, like two goat tails hanging from the back of the jacket. Love Speaking that. of goats, I feel like this new direction you're taking me in would take away from my love of animals. Mm. Like rabbits, for instance. I like to have them very close I, okay, to Okay, all right. I mean, we could we, could work, we could work some rabbits or, or, or doves. In we could do the, both. Yeah, both. why not? Why not? How, what? Or if you wore a slightly oversized suit. Now, hear me out here. Okay. You know, yeah. it'd be padded out with, like, enough doves to make you look, you know, maybe even a little more muscular. Doves in my clothing? Yeah, yeah, Rabbits in the hat, Make them, make them appear tall. out of nowhere. Wow them, you know? It's tall like the rabbit's ears, and right? You know what I was thinking for a big finish? Big finish? What's that? We could put you in, like, a vat of water or something. I could turn that into wine. Or, uh, well, what I was thinking is, is like, we could, we could, like, put a blanket over that. And then, oh, my God, is he going to drown in there? But when we take the blanket away, you're not in there. Or that, or, or... We nail you to a cross for three days and put you in a tomb, and then you come out of the tomb just fine. I love it. Let's do that. And that's that. how that happens. There you go. <laughs>